Last summer, I decided to solo travel around Europe for 35 days, and this is that story. Bonjour tout le monde! Get ready to explore the incredible city of love, Paris, France, as I take you along for the next 72 hours. If this is the first time you're seeing me, hi, welcome to the channel. My name is Vivian Hennekins and I'm currently in my second country out of nine on this 35-day Ultimate Europe trip with EF Ultimate Break. EF Ultimate Break is the perfect way for anyone ages 18 to 35 to travel the world with ease. From their detailed itineraries to their amazing tour guides and even their payment plan options, they really do take all of the hassle out of travel. They have incredible trips all across the world. And you can save $100 on your first trip with EF by booking through the link down in the description. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out seeing all of the other incredible places we'll be visiting on this five week adventure. Now, let's get into Paris. of the trip we have made it to France I went to France this summer with my mom and had the most incredible time I'm so happy to be back here in France we just checked into our hostel and we're hanging out just relaxing today here in central France and then tomorrow we will be heading up to Paris All right, here's a little room tour of our hostel here in Paris. We have a cute little view here of the courtyard down below. We have two showers this time because there are six of us, thank God. I'm staying over here. One more window, another gorgeous view. And then Emma is lucky and has her own little corner. at the Notre Dame Cathedral. We are currently doing our orientation walk here in Paris. And after that, we'll be this is Marios, our incredible tour guide. He's basically in charge of taking us safely from place to place, but Marios absolutely exceeded all expectations and planned so many fun additional activities for everyone in the group all throughout the trip. Heading to our Hi. cabaret dinner. I'm the tour director here. Mm -hmm. This is Marios. We go later to the cabaret. One of the best cabarets here, and I'm so excited to see it. Hi. Hi. So here we are at the Palace of Versailles. I have been here before this summer with my mom and I really enjoyed it. So 
I am really excited to go and get to walk through all of it again, especially to go see the Hall of Mirrors again because when I came in June, this whole palace was absolutely packed. There was people everywhere. And as you can see, there's really not too many people here. I'd say probably like a third of the people that were here in June. But yeah, let's go in. The Palace of Versailles holds a rich history dating all the way back to the 17th century. Originally a hunting lodge built by Louis XII in 1624, it was transformed by Louis XIV, aka the Sun King, into a grand palace that symbolized absolute monarchy. The construction began in 1661, and over the years, it expanded into an architectural masterpiece with magnificent gardens, grand apartments, and the iconic Hall of Mirrors. Versailles became the seat of power, hosting lavish parties and serving as the center of French political and cultural life. It witnessed significant events like the signing of the Treaty of Versailles, which ended World War I. In the next video, we will be exploring the beautiful city of London, England. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and leave any of your thoughts below in the comments. And if you missed my last video where we kicked things off in Barcelona, you can watch that one right over here. See you in London!